Darius Ferrantes. He wears number three. Couple of claps. Time throws that ball right side. Nearly picked off. Really well timed, well executed defensively by Corey Parker. Here they come. Ferrantes has to sidearm that football incomplete as he was being decked by Tyler Christ. And the drive played outstanding defense on that play. He will take a handoff and throw it over the middle. Incomplete. Good defensive effort. Incompleted pass. There's the snap, Hollis Mathis on the left side with a big opening, that's Bronson Yoder across the 50, down to the 40, down to the 38 yard line, Mr. Official. Move those chains. They will run it to the right, however, that's Hollis, he's at the 10. Five to the two to the one. Touchdown, William and Mary. Touchdown, green and gold. Albert Funderburg got that football and he took off and gets into the end zone. Third touchdown of the year for Albert Funderburg. Third down and eight, back to pass he goes. Short drop over the middle, incomplete. Knocked down by one of those up front guys and they're congratulating Bill Murray. Pitch back right side, that's Isaiah Coulter, and he is upended behind the line of scrimmage, Isaiah Laster. Fumble the football, let's see. Naeem Jones or William and Mary, they're already pointing towards the drive. Coming out with a big play last week, Gavin Johnson. The Tribe has a first 10. They're going to go long again. Zach Burdick on the run, makes the catch inside the 20 and down to the 19. Into the red zone with a nice pass from Mathis to his favorite receiver. <laughs> And 
Barry this time. Hollis Mathis, 5, 3, 1. Touchdown, William and Barry. Touchdown, green and gold. Hollis Mathis took off on the right side. Had some great downfield blocking, and the tribe is up two TDs. We talked about on the open, Jay. Hollis Mathis, is his ability to uh, escape pressure and make some people miss, and that time, good job. Made one guy miss in the backfield, and then those long legs streaking down that field. Gets hit as he gets to the goal line, but easily gets in right here. A little fake dive and running the option. Good job getting upfield and making a few players miss. Second and three, Priori with the snap, back to pass, over the middle, that ball's gonna be intercepted by William and Barry. That ball's intercepted by Miles Hayes, the 6'3 senior out of Cincinnati. The second interception of the year. Center is Ryan Ripley. It's the second down and short. Quarterback Mathis on a reverse, coming back this way, running the football, and down the sideline he goes 20 at the 10. That's Zach Burdick eludes a tackler into the end zone. Touchdown, William and Mary. Touchdown, green and gold. Zach Burdick this time runs across for his second touchdown of the year. The first one was via the air. This one is a nice run. Priori, back to pass, in the pocket, hit, Balls out. and that he sure is, it's still on the ground, still there, and I think William & Mary finally comes up with it at the 25-yard line. Tyler Christ recovers that ball. This drive started at the 17. It's been a decent one so far, but that will uh, slow things down, slow that train down a little bit. Justice Antrim is thrown for a loss in the Rhode Island backfield. Captain Nate gets through there, another tackle for loss. Does a good job getting through the uh, offensive line there. Here's C.J. Carrick, extra point, where he is 26 of 27 this year, and it's blocked by Bill Murray. Bill Murray gets his eighth block of his career. That one was uh, right between the nine and the five. He just gets into that backfield so quickly on those uh, extra point and field goal attempts.
That's another flip. And that is getting away down the sideline of the 50. That is Donovan Lester of the 40. Still on his feet of the 30. Got one man in the feet of the 20. He did. Five, three, one. Touchdown, William and Mary. Touchdown, Green and Gold. Donovan Lester. And let's give some credit to Hollis Mathis. I don't see how he got him the football. Uh, there was nothing there. Hollis Mathis steps in the pocket, avoids the, the blitz from Rhode Island, and flips it to his running back. Three, their backup freshman quarterback going it downfield. That is picked off at the 38-yard line. That's Miles Hayes inside the 20 and all the way down to the 13-yard line. Second pick of the day for William and Mary and the tribes in business. Trying to get to 35 before the end of the first half. Here's Hollis Mathis, handoff to Bronson Yoder, cuts back at the five, to the three, he wants it, he gets it. Touchdown, William and Mary. Touchdown, Bronson Yoder. Off. That's the left side. That's a big hole. That is on right. He's down the sideline of the 30. He's at the 20. He's at the 10. And he will get into the end zone. Touchdown, William and Mary. Touchdown, Green and Gold. Owen Wright goes across for the fifth time this year. And the Tribe goes on top, 41 to 6. William Mary didn't go cool off at halftime. Now at 41 to 6. C.J. Carrick with the another block, point, and they blocked it again. Bill Murray again, wow. and he's got the ball. He's moving, Jay. Eddie oh, might get called an illegal forward pitch. We'll see. Bronson Yoder on the left. Bronson gets away. He's at the 25 and at the 30. He's got a blocker in front of him trying to hedge that bet inside the 40, inside the 35, and down to the 33-yard line. That puts Bronson Yoder way above the 100-yard uh, game this afternoon. Quarterback Hollis Mathis on right is to Hollis's right. Back to pass he goes, and he steps up in the pocket. Now will elude a tackler. Now throw that ball downfield right on target for a first down at the 20-yard line. Mr. Official, move those chains. That's Magoo.
They'll fake the handoff. Roll to the right. Touchdown, Hollis Mathis. Touchdown, green and gold. That's a design run all the way. Great job blocking on the goal line by Seth Dunn. Helped get Hollis Mathis in that end zone. So William Mary just a couple away from putting half a hundred up on the Rams. Punter, Davey Sean Bartocci in the game for Rhode Island. And he's going to, it is a fake, trying to get that first down. And he's knocked out of bounds at the 30 yard line. Cal Key delivered a big hit. And the handoff left side, got they it. got it, sure did, inside the 20, inside the 15, and down to the 14-yard line. That is the record as Elijah Burns gets the six-plus yards the Tribes needs. This is the best rushing uh, attack in one game in William & Mary history. The final score from Zabel Stadium, William & Mary 55 and Rhode Island 19.